L.R. the liberal redneck here, coming to you from a country where Moscow Mitch McConnell froze up like a popsicle and no Republican called for him to step down, where a convicted rapist, tax cheat, and felon is still their choice for president of the United States, and Democrats are throwing their own president under the bus for a bad debate. It's a truly sickening thing to behold. The Republicans, right or wrong, circle the wagons around their embattled colleagues, but the Democrats are failing miserably at protecting the back of our president. I have the greatest respect for Kamala Harris and think she would be an able president. But no human being on the planet was more qualified to be president than Hillary Clinton, and we know how that ended. The gutless Democrats calling for President Biden to step down should be shamed for their treachery against their own. In a newly released video, former President Fellon called President Biden an old broken-down pile of crap. He said Vice President Harris is so effing bad, she's pathetic. The Democrats' response has been decidedly lukewarm. I support one Democratic voter who said, I will vote for President Biden's corpse over Trump. Republicans are pushing President Biden's age because their policies are so corrupt and don't hold up to scrutiny. It's time for you doubting Democrats to take a chill pill. President Biden does not single-handedly guide the country. He does have help. He has surrounded himself with a cabinet of the finest, most productive, liberal-leaning minds, both men and women, of all ages, and he takes their advice often and seriously. He has an incredible record of service to the legislative bodies of our country. Be confident that every decision he makes in his presidency is thought about, discussed, scrutinized, purified, and finalized by the same group of great minds that he has gathered together and depended on for many years. We are in very capable hands and need to keep it that way. President Biden is definitely old. Former President Fellon is definitely old. And a traitor, a rapist, a thief, a philanderer, and above all a liar who is deathly afraid of the man who kicked his ass in 2020. It's time to support our president and send the lying felon away forever. Thanks for listening and remember... Always vote blue.